Welcome to Audio, Audio for Travel. Today, we'll walk through location and notification preferences, creating your account, exploring stories, using the story player, and my stories. Audio enhances any trip by notifying you of undiscovered stories nearby and can be used while traveling or for browsing at home. For Audio to work properly, you'll need to enable location sharing and notifications. As your location changes, you'll come into a range of different stories. The Audio app will notify you when you're near a story you haven't heard before. Once you've listened to a story, it won't automatically play again unless you clear your history. Because of this, no two trips with Audio are the same, and even the smallest detour can lead you to discover many new stories. When you open the Audio app, we'll request that you share your location and allow notifications. First, tap Select Location Permissions and select Allow while using app. Next, tap Select Notifications Permissions and select Allow. If you need to change these permissions later, you can do so through iOS settings. To bookmark, download, and favorite stories, you'll need to create an account. Select Sign Up if you're new to Audio, or Sign In if you have an existing account. If you'd like to try out Audio first, you can select Continue as Guest. Whether you sign up or continue as a guest, you'll get five free stories to listen to. You can choose a plan to access Audio's full library of stories at any time. Once you've used your five free stories, you'll need to select a plan to continue. The map allows you to browse every story in the Audio library. Try pinching and zooming or moving the map around to browse stories. You can use the Location button at any time to return to your current location on the map. Near the bottom of the map, you'll see the Persistent Player. This will always show the currently playing story. Below the player is the Up Next bar. This will show you the next story that will play. If you want to skip the current story and begin playing this Up Next story, tap the Next button at the right. Audio plays nicely with other apps, so you can have your navigation and other audio apps running at the same time. If Audio is in the background, just make sure you have location preferences set to Always and Notifications enabled, so we can notify you when you're nearby a story you haven't heard before. You can toggle between a map and list view depending on how you'd like to browse. The list will only show the stories in view on the map. If you'd like to see where a story is located, select the corresponding pin on the right of the story you'd like to view. This will reveal its location back on the map. Tapping a story pin on the map will reveal an information card with the story's title and narrator. You can tap the play button to start listening to the story, tap the story title to get more information, Tap Bookmark to add this to your bookmarks list, or tap the three dots at the right to like, download, get directions, or share this story. A great way to discover stories for future destinations or about specific topics is search. You can search by keywords, location, or narrator to find exactly what you're looking for. Tap any of the results to get a preview of that story. If you tap the Player button at the tab bar along the bottom of your screen, you get a full screen view of the currently playing story. At the top of the screen, you'll see an image related to the story with Like, Share, AirPlay or Google Cast, Feedback, and More icons. Tapping the More icon will allow you to download the story or Get directions. Below the story title, you'll see the narrator's name. Tapping on this will reveal a bit about the narrator, as well as other stories they've narrated. Next, we have playback options. 
you can adjust the speed at which the story plays. Go back 15 seconds, play or pause, skip to the next story, or bookmark the story. As you move down the player, you'll find a short description of the story, as well as a map view. Tapping the map or the Get Direction button below the map will prompt you to open your favorite Maps app for navigation. Similar to the map screen, you'll see an Up Next bar with the title of the next story that will be played. My Stories contains your bookmarked stories, favorited stories, and a history of stories you've listened to. These lists are all private to you and not visible to anyone else. Bookmarks are a great way to keep track of stories you'd like to listen to in the future. Favorites make it easy to listen to stories you've already enjoyed. And history can help you find a story you've listened to in the past. While you can download individual stories from the map or from any of these playlists, one of the best ways to prepare for your travels are to download stories by state. You can browse by country and then by state and territory. Once you've tapped Download, it's best to keep your app open until the download is complete. Audio's location-based stories can enhance any trip. We can't wait for you to bring us along on your next adventure. If you have any questions, never hesitate to reach out to our support team. You can send us a message on any of our social accounts or email support at audio.com. Safe travels.